This is a quick tour of our DIY home theatre that's been built over the last 18 months. So what we have is a 120 inch screen we've got a 7.4.2 system so there's seven base level speakers four in the ceiling and two subwoofers uh, we've got the acoustically transparent screen so speaker one speaker two speaker three are in behind the screen subwoofer in the corner subwoofer in the corner and then for our surrounds these are behind these two black panels in the middle and then we've got the rear surrounds up the back here, which are just bookshelf speakers. We've got lighting in the chairs, lighting in the seats. You've got these dimmable sconces, which are wall dimmable and can be dimmed by an app. Uh, all the ceiling RGB and the stairs RGB we turned off at the switch. The lighting for the chairs is all separate. It tends to spill a bit of light onto the screen though, so we tend not to use those too often. We've got our acoustic panels. The black ones are for absorption. The white ones are for scattering. Uh, we've got the, the black split system AC. Keep the room nice and cool. You can see the four Atmos speakers up there. For the speakers we've got for the Atmos and the surrounds, they're Polk V65 in-wall speakers. And then JBL uh, rear surrounds, JBL bookshelves, and JBL Balboa, three identical towers, one, two, and three behind the screen, and 10-inch JBL subs at each of the corners. A projector is a UHD 66, Optima UHD 66. Our amp is a Denon X3800H with 11.4 channels of processing, um, but it only amplifies 9.4 channels. So we have another amp, another small stereo amp in there as well, running uh, the two rear Atmos speakers. Uh, we're running the Google TV with Chromecast. Uh, and Plex and Netflix and all that jazz. Um, what else have we got? Oh, yeah, you've got the couches, so two sides recline. And then the center couch folds out. Got a couple more cup holders, wireless phone charger, and then a couple USB ports and GPO there. More USB ports in the side. And the great thing about these couches is that the footrest is separate to the headrest, so you can move the headrest separately, which is excellent. Uh, all our panels up here against the screen are speaker fabric. Uh, the screen... hinges out like so if we ever need to get in there but we can't see a lot might be able to see the amp in the middle speaker we'll put on a little demo our in surround sound
So there you go. Flick the regular lights on, sort of see it in the daytime. That's all we have today. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.